Hello guys, this is Vishal and I'm here with the new topic 5 lakh duty intersection design with a numerical. So as you can see, the question is in the form of PCU table. It is not necessary that always the question is in this form. It can be in any other form like uh, it can be in the form of bus, truck, cars and other type of vehicles. So first step ever is to convert those traffic data into this PCU table. So PCU conversion table is also given by multiplying the various traffic in the form of various uh, types like bus, truck, cars, etc. We'll multiply that traffic with the PCU conversion factors and we'll get the values as given in this table. Other than this, value of E, W and L. These are also given in the question if not given there are various scores for this so we can assume these values as per those scores so let us assume and rotate intersection which is 5 lakh i have already told you in the previous uh, video how to calculate the maximum capacity so formula is there Q is equal to 280W into 1 plus E upon W into 1 minus P upon 3 upon 1 plus W upon L. So from this formula we get that P which is weaving ratio is directly proportional to maximum capacity. So what we need to do? We don't need to calculate the maximum capacity for each section but we need to calculate weaving ratio. So for the section which is having the maximum weaving ratio among all, we'll directly know that maximum capacity will occur in that section only so starting with the section 1 and 2 we'll calculate this weaving ratio for all sections we are starting from section 1 2 so it is easy to calculate all the four turns a b c and d as i have directed also in this uh, picture you can see the volume of traffic which is coming from first leg to second leg is A and from first leg to uh, third, fourth and fifth leg is B and from third, fourth and fifth leg to second leg is C and from fifth leg to third and fourth and fourth leg to third leg is D. So by using this criteria we can calculate the terms a b c and d it is already written here so once we know what type of traffic is this a b c and d by using this table in the question that is pcu table we can calculate the number of vehicles so after calculating a b c and d we can calculate the p which is weaving ratio similarly for all other section I have elaborated in detail for section 1, 2 and section 2 and 3 and uh, for other section I have not elaborated in detail because these are also the same so we can calculate easily. Now once we have the various values of uh, weaving ratio for all the sections we can choose the maximum one here maximum weaving ratio is 0 0.634 which is for section 5 and 1 so next step will be to calculate the maximum capacity so using the values of e w and l we'll put that all values in the formula of maximum capacity and we get here maximum capacity is 5918.154 so approximately 5918 pcu is the maximum capacity of that section so it is our designed value so we need to check whether the traffic in the section is less than that value or more than that value so here a plus b plus c plus d is the current traffic moving in that section it is double four three four which is less than the maximum capacity means design is okay but in case if capacity is less and uh, traffic is more means congestion is occurring in that section in that case what is the solution we need to redesign the uh, rotary with the different values of e w and l means we need to increase the radius 
and uh, the weaving width and the weaving length of that rotary so that capacity should be increased so by doing so we can design our rotary it is not necessary that uh, this criteria is only for the four or five legged even if the legs are more we can calculate for those also because at one time we need to uh, take only one section for that we are calculating so comparing all the sections we calculate the maximum capacity thank you